Hello and welcome to my Let's Play, everybody. Uh, in the past, I've made it known that I'm a big Digi ah, Digimon fan. Okay, and uh, yeah. And today, I'm going to be bringing you Digimon World Redigitize. Through my eyes and through a patched version that was recently released in the summer. And this, for those of you who are just tuning in, this is actually part two. I'm actually not going to do part one until... Oh, hold on. Menu. Menu screen. Load game. Okay, let me see which file I'm going to load. Uh, okay, I don't want to do four because I actually had to play through the game a little bit to understand what I was going to do. Okay, I am going to do this one featuring my Digimon Metal Greymon. Yeah, yeah, this takes place before having, like, after the training I had done and before I had actually gone into the forest to recruit some Digimon. Okay, so let me see. I'll give you a grand tour of my Digimon stats. Partner info. Okay, let's see. Oh, and I apologize if some of the music, if you can hear an echo, if some of the music gets into my recording because I'm actually using a Call of Duty Black Ops headset. Uh, and I tested it. Some of the music does actually, you know, you can hear an echo in it. I heard it when it did my sound recorder testing. Um, so far, so good. Um, these stats for Metal Greymon are actually... They pale in comparison to the criteria to, to use a Metal Greymon in Digimon World 1. Yes, that's right. I played the original game, so I know what half of what the hell I'm doing in this game. In this new iteration. Okay, so yeah. HP is 32.55. MP is 26.53. Offense is 232. Defense is 375. Like, I know I'm going on and on about the obvious. Uh, but I'm just making sure... I'm just making sure that... Uh, what am I saying? Uh, the point is... I'm ch double checking these stats to see if I can do better because when you got an ultimate Digimon, the stats are at like 300 or greater. And the weight is 50 grams. My goal here is I'm, that I'm trying to evolve into War Greymon, except I can't go to the Coliseum because I don't have Greymon. Yeah, so in part two of this video, I'm going to go to the forest and, and recruit some Digimon along the way. Uh, the prosperity rate, I'll check with Gigimon to see what number it is, and I am not going to do a lot of commentary in this playthrough. I'm actually going to speak as I go, because I, I don't do well with trying to with trying to speak at the same time, as though this were scripted. That's what I should say. What's the prosperity rate? The city's current prosperity rate is 2. If you seek Digimon during your travels, try to persuade them to return to the city. Okay, okay. And I'm going to check my items, and here we have... Let's see. Oh, wow. MP floppy. Hmm. I'm gonna check with Gabumon here and see what I left behind. Gabumon is the Digimon from season two who was actually who actually belonged to Matt. Let's see, retrieve items. Storage space is currently empty. Do I want to leave anything behind? No, not really. I have 80 slots. Nothing, thanks. Okay, what do you have to say? I try investing in meat futures market. Yeah, there's this really weird thing where you get to invest in the meat market where... I mean, if you've played Digimon World 1, you're kind of familiar with receiving meat from a farm. I know, I know. Let that sink in. I I'm playing a game about creatures appearing as data and growing meat in the fields. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go out into the city because I've done enough training, at least, to get by. Oh, and the one really shitty thing about starting a game and having a Digimon right away, it's that you have, let's see, let's go into skills, this is my example. You only have one technique. How the hell can you get by with one technique? I mean, it, it, you at least had like maybe one or two in the original, maybe like that you could use. I mean, it, it's like techniques are exclusive to some Digimon. That's nothing new, but you can't use the other techniques that you've already were able to use. As Agumon, I assume that you can use all of these because I've only raised Digimon up until this point. I've only had Agumon, Greymon, and up to Metal Greymon. So I only have one technique, which is not going to get me by a lot. Okay, and here's the, uh, one Digimon I intend to recruit. Merrimon. Hmm, things aren't going very well. Let's see, what should I do? That's life, or what's the matter? 
I may not look like it, but I'm actually a chef. I came all the way out here to get some ingredients, but if I move around carelessly, I might start a forest fire. Huh, good point. Smokey the Bear would say. Uh, I can find them for you is actually the choice you're supposed to go with. The green Digimushroom is just what it sounds like. It's a Digimushroom and it's green, and it would help me out if you could find five of them. I'll wait here for you. Okay, sure. I'm gonna collect this. Orange Banana. If I remember right, Orange Banana in Digimon World 1 lets you digivolve to Edamon. What's over here? Okay, I know what this is, having actually traveled through here. This is actually a giant... Well, not giant, but it's a complete circle. Yeah, so I'm gonna find some Digimushrooms, and I'm gonna look for Digimon in particular. Let's see here. Ah, there's one. And here's one of the first few Digimon you can recruit to the city. Wanyamon. What are you doing? Playing. Everyone left the city, so I went on an adventure. With no adults around, no one's gonna scold me now, no matter what I do. Let's see. Keep it down, please. That's the one to go with. Uh, you know, it would really suck that you could you could never recruit some of these Digimon if you went with the wrong choice of dialogue. Okay, so what do we have now? Uh, I guess we can see where this way takes us. Oh, I know this is Ancient Bone Swamp. You can't actually go here because you need a key some to something. You need a key to open an iron door. Uh, I've already been through here, so let's just grab the mushroom here. And there's a Psychemon. It's just a... Uh, it's not really inverted. I wanted to say inverted, but it's actually just a differently colored Gabumon with no new techniques. Uh, let's see here. And look, a legitimate Gabumon. Who isn't... <laughs> It was in a friggin' uh, painted ripoff of the other. Okay, uh, let's see. I'm, I'm gonna do my best not to say um a lot. Digimushroom 1. Okay, here's our next Digimon. Greymon. Oh, it's rare to see a human here. Are you here to train too? Yeah, I'm training. Yeah, because if you say training is for the week, he probably won't talk to you. Or just passing through will probably result in him not wanting to converse. Why don't we try sparring? We can both improve. Now let's go. A match. A match. A Greymon versus a Metal Greymon. It's kind of weird to see the natural evolution of it of a particular Digimon fighting uh, his predecessor. I just feel it's kind of weird. Uh. I am not going to use full power because I could, like, I not full power, I'm sorry, the special attack, the Giga Destroyer, because I could find a better use for that, unleashing it in the Colosseum, because for those of you who remember or are not aware, Greymon in Digimon World 1 was responsible for setting up a tournament in which Digimon could fight each other and win prizes. This Greymon is very much the same in that sense. There, I beat him. Did I learn anything? No, I got quarter body. Yeah. I wonder why I don't get techniques. Oh, right, because you can only get them from certain Digimon. And I may not be able to get... I can only learn mechanical techniques. Oh, let's see, I'll tell my name. Well, that's not actually true. I can learn most mechanical. Most techniques that are mechanical. But I can't use any other type. Uh, at least to my knowledge. I'm going to return to the city. I'm going to be a receptionist. I'm the receptionist at the Coliseum. I think that's... Ah, whatever. I'm not here to question the grammar or the or the phrasing of the translation for the patch. I'm just here to play it. He says, I'm the receptionist, like he's already there. Greymon has returned to File City. Okay, what do we have here? Meat. Meat. He's hungry. Okay, yeah, it takes about five to six pieces of, of meal. Five to six meat, like, little pieces of meat to satisfy his hunger. Uh, let's see what's over here. I think I've been here. You got mail. Digivice. Evolution info. Let's see, player. Get him's cards. 
mail. There we go. Here's where it is in the login section. Uh, let's see. What am I looking for? Um, where is it? Where is it? Oh, here we go. Uh, when I was playing before, I found a card so you can have an attached file. Chumon. Okay, what's over here? Oh, shoot. I'm going around in a complete circle. I know where I'm going. It was a lot easier to go through areas when you had this isometric perspective over the cam- like, as the camera in Digimon World 1. An isometric perspective is when the camera is above- It's like if you play Diablo or Marvel, um, Ultimate Alliance, or Marvel Heroes, where the camera is above the character. Wait a minute, what is this? Oh, shoot. I thought this would be a legitimate Kabuterimon. Oh, no. Great, I'm gonna have to waste my full power here. Or maybe not. If I go down to 2,000, I'll probably use the Giga Destroyer. I have no choice. Well, I nearly have no choice at this point. Ugh. Let's see what kind of situation I'm in. Okay, I've taken out half his health. He's only taken a small chunk of mine. And that poison's not going to go well for any Digimon under my tamer ship. Uh, please don't drown out my MP. Did he just regenerate? What the hell did he do? Oh, I get it. Some Digimon don't really feel like battling, but are, but almost feel like they're forced to. Okay, I'm now down to 1800. Oh, no. Oh, thank you. Defense up. Ah, oh, thank you. Jesus. And yes. learn any skills. Okay, but so far, so good. Uh, let's take a look at the signs here. I want that Digimushroom. Green Digimushroom. What's down here? Ancient Bone Swamp. No, I'm not going down there. I have to go back uh, this way. Before I hit the 15 minute mark, I'm hoping to at least get out and go back and save and rest. Mm. I've got mail. From who? Not items. Digivice. Log mail. Yeah, there we go. Let's fight. TY. There's a strong guy here with an Agumon for a partner. Are you him? Fight with my Agumon, see which one is stronger. I register my entry in the first floor Coliseum, and I'm waiting for you there. At the Coliseum. The Coliseum is an area on the north side of the city. You and your partner can test your strength. Win excellent prizes. I'll be there at the reception desk. I've endorsed an item for the support of your victory. Offense chip. Oh, sweet. Okay. Okay, for later, though. Oh, there's the city. Where is this? Sewer Maze. Ancient Bone Swamp. Oh, I just realized. Sewer Maze is the one with the locked door. Uh, Ancient Bone Swamp. I don't know what it is, but I'll, I'll probably check that out another time. Okay, where is the item? There it is. Shit. I'm having trouble with the controls just because the button to press anything... It was X in the past. Now I have to get used to Circle, because I am playing with a controller reminiscent to the uh, PlayStation settings. Uh, because this is the PSP emulator. Uh, green Digimushroom. Okay, let's go back to the city. I've already recruited two Digimon. I'm already doing well. Doing well for myself. Uh, the first Digimon I actually recruited was a Black Gabumon, and that very Gabumon exists here in that shop. The, no, not really a shop, it, as an item keeper, where he holds on to my items and well, the place where I can deposit them. Uh, okay, let's keep going, let's keep going. I 
I need to adopt more currency. I need to get more items. Shouldn't push yourself too hard. Why don't you rest here? Yes, rest. Yeah, there's a strange thing. Yeah, you know what? I'll save it for later. It was about being able to rest and recover your HP and MP. But uh, here's a bigger distraction right now. Uh, turn the camera left with the L button, and turn the camera right with the R button. And every time that purple icon goes up, you need to go use the restroom. This game is all about promoting good hygiene, whether you're human or Digimon. Mostly Digimon. Okay. I think I'll save the game and then start recording. No, I'll end it at the 16 minute mark. That's what I'll do. Okay, so far so good. Alright, tune in to the part 3. And I'm probably going to stop using numbers and just go by saying it the next part. That's what I'll do. Alright, uh, see you then.